Hey guys, it's Jen. Hope you're all doing good today. It's a nice day here and I got to take our rental car for a drive, first drive, and I gotta say, that thing's loaded. It's awesome. Getting kind of spoiled. <laughs> so, um, what I have, I'm behind on the Simply Random Challenge. Um, I had, I just, week 14 was such a struggle for me. I was just like, I don't want to do it. <laughs> so then, of course, because of that, it held all these other ones back. So I finally got over it and did it. So, all right. So here's week 15. Now, 15, I'm excited about because I did something very, very fun um, for the first time ever. And I'm super excited about it. So I want to show you. So the theme I'm going with this week, uh, let's see, the prompts for this week are washi or masking tape, index card, stenciled, yellow, family, and ribbon. So, <clears throat> stenciled. I created my own stencil, 3D printed. So, I know that I had shown before a couple of uh, stencils that we had uh, printed, but they were someone else's design. I designed this from scratch. Like, I drew the paw print and everything. So, first we printed out big, and that was, like, way too big, big. Sometimes I have a hard time, like, visualizing. It's like, okay, this is going to be, like, you know, a centimeter and a half. And I'm like, okay, but, like... <laughs> so, yeah, this is this one. You can see, or I'll show you the stencils first. And then we did a couple tries of this one. Uh, we did one and it was a little bit blobby. Like some of the toes were a little bit wonky. Oh, you can see that pretty good, eh? Right through there. Nice. And then so we did a second one. Yeah, this is the wonky one with the little wonky toes. And then we did a second one and it's really super thin. Or actually before that, we did this one and it was too thick. And I mean, I could... I could st stencil it. <laughs> I could use a stencil brush. Okay, here's what I did with um, the uh, with a sponge. But then I hauled out a stencil brush and tried that. And I mean, it kind of worked a little bit, but not really. So I'll probably toss that one, I gotta say. But these ones I'll definitely keep. I might even tuck one of these away. I mean, they're not they're not uh, bad. So here's the big one and the little little prints it made. But for this project, I wanted it small. So there's the little one. And look, it's just all those little toe beans. Isn't that so cute? I'm so stoked. It was so fun seeing them print out. <clears throat> I don't know which is which. Let me see here. I mean, they're both pretty good, really. Oh, I think what had happened was one printed. You probably can't really see it on camera, but one printed with like a couple little tiny spaces. Here, I'll show you. With like a couple little tiny spaces, like around outsides oh no that one's got a wonky toe maybe it's that one yeah this one printed with um little spaces like kind of around the outsides but when I did this they didn't come through so that's great if I was using paint instead of ink it probably would so then Rob reprinted it um they made sure the little spaces were filled in there but there is like a couple wonky toes on that so yeah I'll use this one instead <clears throat> all right so let's get started so what I decided to do uh, was go with family. So I'm doing a, a card, index card, yellow index card. I'm doing a card for Artemis's journal because Artemis is my baby. So he is family. So I've got some really cute cat stickers going on. Picked out some cat stickers and some cat ephemera. Like, look at that. These are from a, from a kid's book. Really cute, right? And then these funky stickers that are like puffy. Yeah, and I got some washi tape. Oh, I got a little a little cluster I made. Maybe I can work that in there somewhere. And I haven't used my skinny washi tape in ages. So I'm like, you know what? I'll work that in there. All right. So the first thing I'm going to do is, let's see. I do want to put the big kitty there. And I think I will do, let's see. <clears throat> I don't think it matters which side, but this is the flatter side. This was the one side that was against the plate, the uh, the printing plate. So I will just flip it over and use the other side. Ooh, that's a lot of ink. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be so, uh, that's gonna be an oxide. Yeah, oxide's like super creamy. For some reason, I was thinking it was a dye ink. I was not prepared for this. 
All right. So yeah, you kind of got to do a little dabbing to make sure all the little toe beans are filled in. But it's not, uh, it's not hard. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, I went over the side. Whoops, I could have put a piece of paper there. Isn't that so cute? Look at that, guys. So cute. All right. I am so stoked that I made my own stencil. I'm going to definitely be drawing and printing more. There's a lot of stencils out there that are like, you know, geometric patterns. Like you saw the ones with the little lines that I did. Yeah, geometric patterns. But I need some stencils with... Uh, with um, funky things like paw prints. Okay, they're a little more difficult to clean than a regular stencil because the, actually, you know what? I should have used the, the uh, smoother side um, because it goes in like a, like a crisscross pattern. So you gotta kind of go with the grain to clean it. That looks good. Again, though, I'm the kind of person I don't clean, I don't clean paint off my stencils. I do try to clean ink, though, because ink will just, yeah, run everywhere the next time you use it. So, let me put this over there. There's my little kitty. So, I'm going to put him there. And this is going to be, like, the front of the card. So, more like the focal. And then that will be, like, writing, where I get to write. Let me see. I do have all kinds of little, little kitty things. Hmm. Oh, and I have ribbon. This is the only ribbon I currently have, really. Look at these. Oh, little kitties. Um, yeah, most of the cat tape I have is, uh, cat washi is, um, washi samples I got from other people. This is the only roll, really, that I have left. I had some other cat washi tape, but it's all gone. on over the years. Oh, there's some more. Okay. Ah, let us see. I kind of super like this one. Like, I feel like that needs to be on there for sure. And it fits with the, uh, it definitely fits. I try to keep my washi samples separated. Um, I try to kind of, as I get them in, I put transfer them to other playing cards so that, you know, I organize them onto playing cards so that, yeah, my cats are all together and, and other animals and food. Oh, I like this meow though. Meow's nice. Hmm. Got that. Maybe I'll do, oh, let's see. There's a little baby kitty. <clears throat> little kitty. I feel like we should have something there. Like maybe a paw print. <clears throat> These cute little Japanese stickers. So cute. I love clear backing because then you can see. I love that one. That's cute. Uh, there's always like that or like that. That's kind of really cute. Um, what one would go best? I'm kind of really liking the blue one, but I mean, those are blue. Uh, white with pink. Yeah, let's do the white with pink. I don't know how well these are going to hold. They're kind of older and they're like rubbery puffy stickers. So I'm just going to put some glue stick on there too. Oh. And my fingers are blue. I should be wiping that off. I'm going to get blue ink everywhere here. This is how I craft. I end up with like ink and paint all over me. And all over the place. Okay. There. 
I'm going to put him there. But first, what are we going to put? <clears throat> Do, 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 do. Um, there are some other little kitty stickers, but I don't know. They're kind of see-through-y, so it's kind of like, eh, I don't know. Yeah, these might not work too well because the yellow is going to, like, come right through. Okay. Oh, there's, like, little, yeah, I could put a little fishy. Yeah. A little fishy. Like, that's what he's after. A little fishy toy. Okay, and I'm gonna put him down. cover him. <clears throat> okay. There he is with the, oh wait, I didn't stick down that down with glue. Yeah, definitely needs some glue. Ha! Ah, I took out part of the ink. <laughs> the sticky stuck to the ink. Just like a little, little paw print or a little heart, maybe. Yeah, we'll do a little heart. I'm kind of really digging these paw prints though, with the individual little beans. Like, look at those. Those are so cute. Yeah, maybe I'll do one of those too. Hang on here. I'll just put this there. These are going to be a pain in the butt to do, but I'm going to do it anyway. I wish it was like like the rhinestone stickers that you could get. I don't know if they still do them that way, but it used to be like they, like the, the rhinestone tattoos. You remember those in the late 90s? It was like a little pattern of rhinestones and then they were on, they were sticky. So they were on a paper, but there was a paper on top of them, like a, like a clear plastic and it was sticky. So you take that and yeah, it'll take all the rhinestones off in the pattern so that the back of the rhinestones are facing up and then you put it on your skin and then you can peel the top part off. Yeah. So that would have been great for these. Just saying. If there's any sticker designers out there. <laughs> all right. Let me see if I can get these beans right here. I don't know. Oh, I didn't. Bleh. This is precarious. I'm gonna get glue everywhere. What is that? Where did pink ink come from? What is this? Is that from the sticker? Did I use? I didn't use any pink ink. All right, well, this is what we're doing. Like it's clear, I don't know, or white. That's weird. Or did the glue, oh, the glue turned, the glue turned the yellow card like pinkish. Why? That is so weird. It's just a regular glue stick. Okay, I need, I need to know why. I need to like Google this science-y and find out the scientific reason for this. I'm very curious scientifically. Something something happens that's weird. I'm like, whoa, what is that? I need to figure that out. Like weird, you know, weather or weird 
yeah, I don't know. look at these. These are ridiculous. This was not a good idea. <laughs> I'm sure I have tweezers around here somewhere. It's just to find them. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. So. Here's one. Here's, yep. Good Lord. These are too small. Why did I do this? <laughs> okay, set it on the glue. These tweezers are definitely going to need to be washed. I wonder if that'll turn back to yellow when it dries. If not, that's kind of cool. It makes some really neat effects. Like a splotchy kind of tie-dye look just by rubbing the glue stick over it. I was totally odd, eh? I'm like, what is going on? <laughs> Now this is not staying on there. All right, so we've got, we do have washi tape on there. Family. Oh, Artie's a tuxedo, by the way, so that's a little, little tuxy. Uh, family. Stenciled. Yellow. Index card. So the only thing I'm missing is ribbon, but I am going to decorate the other side. And I think I'll put, like, to kind of cover his tail. I think I'm going to do some. I don't even know if this is sticky anymore. I got this washi tape a long time ago. I didn't really have a decent blue in here, if I remember correctly. I bought this like earthy tone pack. I think it was. I think I got a couple different packs in there. I don't know. Anyway, for some reason, I don't have a good blue. I will kind of just hide that his little tail's got a little gap between it and the side of the. Card. Uh, let's do some green. Oh yeah, I did. I think I got some neons, and then I got some earth tones. The neons I would have bought because I love them, and the earth tones I probably bought because they were on sale. There, just add a little bit of interest. Okay, so that's that side, which is, I guess, like the front. And then the back, where you can write. Let's see. I'm going to put a little bit of ribbon. Do, 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 do. Okay. Grab my other side of tape. Anybody else's husband go in to borrow things from the craft room? Rob came in. He asked me if I had double-sided tape, so I told him where it was. So he came in. It's in my card catalog. And I came in later. He didn't put anything away. The tapes were out all over the place. The drawer was still open. And I don't think he brought me back the roll of tape that he borrowed. Double-sided tape. Yeah. Just saying. Thank you. 
fire. I mean, you know, this is the only ribbon that I had out, not packed away currently, that I could, you know, easily find. Oh no. Oh no, I had to use the rainbow heart ribbon. <laughs> I think if I, I've already used it in one of these, uh, in one of the uh, Simply Random Challenge ephemeras or embellishments, haven't I? But that's okay. That's okay. I can use it again. Okay, and we'll put a little. I kind of want to do like a little. Like I like that. I like these guys because they were like peeking over the edge. Oh, well, maybe I could do that. Yeah, do that and then put a little. A little dude in the middle of it. I kind of don't want to cover the whole paisley. I'm gonna want to. I'm gonna want to glue glue this. I got this Lean's School Tacky Glue on sale. It's a big bottle. And I think the only difference, like, it's a little, maybe a little thinner than their tacky glue, but not even really. So, I mean, fine with me. It was on sale. We are good. Okay, there we go. Little kitty. Oh, is that gonna, meh. Maybe I will trim that down, actually. So it's not all shaggy over the edge with the, yeah, the white and stuff. There, just kind of squared a little bit. <clears throat> now, yeah, I really love him. He's kind of cute too, though. And I love the little meow, meow, meow. But that doesn't really go. Uh, this one kind of, this one's kind of cute too. I wanted to do, maybe use this one. I need to do more kitty themed things. Maybe someday I'll do a kitty journal. That would be awesome. I'd love to have a kitty journal. That is in the far future. I've got a list of journals I want to make. I got a couple that I'm going to be making um, in the near future that I can make without having access to all of my packed away supplies. Supplies. But, um, yeah, I have also a big list of things, of ones that uh, I would like to make that, yeah, all the stuff is packed away. Maybe I should have brought him down a little bit. Oh, well, whatever. I feel like there should be something along the top there, too. Okay. Well, maybe not. Maybe that's a little extra. Oh, wait. I kind of like this cool cat tape. I thought it would go kind of neat with these cards, with this card. Okay. Let's see how it looks. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Maybe I'll put another little, little kitty down here. Maybe that, you think? Yeah, I think so. Although I kind of like a little chubby birthday kitty. He's cute too. Oh, a little baby kitten. No, I think he fits best. So we will put him down. Yeah, these were from a... Um, a kid's book and it was just a French kid's book and oh the artwork and it was just beautiful not just the cats like all the little kids and stuff that were drawn like the people oh beautiful there. there I don't have a whole lot of room left to write but you know I could do a little bit of writing Actually, here, I can take a bit off here. Leave myself a little more room to write. Yeah, there we go. 
I'll just write a little blurb. So this is my, I really like this, I gotta say, week 15 um, um, embellishment for the Simply Random Challenge. So I've got all the information below. Go check out the challenge. You can start anytime. It doesn't matter. Like, it's not a time constraint thing. Um, yeah. So hope you enjoyed. I had a lot of fun with this one, all bright and kitties. So thanks for watching and uh, take care. Bye.